So as you can see, we are not in my usual room. We're not even putting this up on Wednesday. What's going on, you're asking? Well, it's funny you should say that because Warner Brothers sent me this. So yeah, in all seriousness, somebody in Warner Brothers contacted me and asked if I wanted to receive some Batman vs Superman stuff to unbox for all you guys, and of course I'm gonna say yes. You may have seen other YouTubers do unboxings of this, and I just can't believe that Warner Brothers thinks that we're at the same level as like Greg Miller or something. This isn't a paid endorsement, I'm not getting any money for this, this is just me opening up a box with a lot of Batman and Superman stuff in it. So with that out of the way, let's get this over with. As you can see, it's got the two characters on the side, and also this side is Superman, this side is Batman, the other side is them again. And open it up, you just twist the top and unfolds like that. I have not seen what's in here yet, so this is gonna be a surprise. First up, we have some nice trading cards in cool protective cases and a letter introducing me to the DC Comics superhero team. Finally. What else we got here? We got the pop vinyl of Nightmare Batman. And we got a uh, metal die cast Superman. This is actually, it's, they're not lying. This is heavy. That feels like it's real metal. What else we got here? Oh, oh wow, this is fancy. Uh, a, a Lego superhero set with the Batwing and a whole bunch of characters on there. Batman, Superman, Wonder Woman, and Lex Luthor. Uh, Lex Luthor is bald, spoiler alert. They could have just sent me the Legos. Anybody who doesn't like Legos, don't trust them. You don't want to know that person. What else we got here? What's this? Um, okay. So in July of last year, around San Diego Comic-Con, when they were announcing all the merchandise for Batman vs Superman, I said, and I tweeted this out, that the thing I'm most excited for is the Wonder Woman Barbie doll. And <laughs> now I own it. I kind of wish I had a daughter now so I can give her this so she can have a good role model instead of the regular Barbie. This is, this is fantastic. What else we got in here? What's the, Batman, this is just a plain white box. It says, the, oh, this is from Mattel. Okay, let's, let's open it. Excuse me a second. All right, what is this? This is instruction. Oh, this is this is battery powered. What I got is battery powered. Um, all right, what is <laughs> let's make a noise and okay. Oh, it's got speakers in it. All right, this looks like they're really fancy Batman and Superman uh, figures. Back when the Dark Knight came out, this line was called the Movie Masters, and I'm pretty sure this is supposed to be in line with that. These are. You know, high detail, high articulation figures. These are these are really nice. They are keeping with the same quality that the Movie Masters Dark Knight figures were. It says, does something. Let me press the button. That's sweet. Let's get this over here. If I'm obscuring anything, I'm sorry. What else we got? We got a hat. And hey, it fits. Look at that. What else we got here? We have... Okay, this is one of those uh, metal build-your-own things. I have no idea like when these things became popular, but like I see them everywhere. And now I have one for the new Batmobile. And we got a whole bunch of shirts. We have <laughs> an Under Armour Batman shirt. This is actually really cool. If I ever decide to work out, I will definitely be doing it in this. We got that, and then we just got regular shirts. We got Superman. I'm blocking a whole bunch of stuff, probably. Uh, we got Batman, of course. And we have my initials, Will Wolf. No, that's some kid and it's Wonder Woman. So thank you so much to Warner Brothers DC for sending this stuff to me. I cannot believe I'm sitting here right now doing an unboxing for all this awesome, awesome stuff. And thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you do all the usual YouTube things, like, share, subscribe, comment, and I will see you next time. Have a good week. All this month, DC has had Batman vs Superman themed variants for a lot of their titles for obvious reasons. And they've all been polybagged, meaning that it's a mystery as to what cover you get. So I decided to put together a list of some Superman comics you either forgot about or didn't even know existed, but you should definitely pick them up. These are my top five underrated Superman stories.